years, 10 years ago, I mean, tell me a little bit about what grade were you in, what were your interests, what were you doing? You were just a young kid. Yes, ma'am. I was, I was in second grade at the time. I was still here at Parrish, and um, I don't really remember much. I remember when the, uh, one of the maintenance guys came in to tell the teacher what was going on. I was sitting close to the door, and I could kind of hear a little bit what was going on. And uh, I just remember him saying that there's been something awful, and um, that they needed her out in the hallway. And she left, and then she came back in. And the next thing I know, my mom's coming to get me. So. What did your parents share about that day? I mean, what, how did they try to explain to you? How old were you in second grade? You were. I was eight. You were eight. Yes. How did they? How did they explain to an eight-year-old what had, what had happened that day? Uh, I don't remember it all. All the detail, but I do remember that we, uh, it was over dinner because we sat down at dinner and they kind of, I'm not really sure like, exactly what they said, but they eased into it and kind of tried to explain a little bit, a little bit piece by piece, and then we talked about, talked about it more and more in detail in uh, the classes over the next couple of weeks. What did you talk about in class? About um, just about different kinds of different like the possibilities of what it could have been and different safety precautions. Uh, and I remember there's a lot of a lot of stuff about heroes and about how uh, the firefighters and police officers and a lot of people stepped up and were thrown into extraordinary uh, situations and had to step up and take on a lot of leadership roles and basically help out in any way they could. I remember we talked a lot about that about how heroic a lot of people had to become. Mm -hmm. So for an eight-year-old, what did you, do you remember what you felt inside? I mean, did you feel scared? You must have seen some of the images on TV, yes, didn't I was, you? I, I was scared. I remember being really, really scared, and I didn't know what was going to happen to me, like anywhere where I was going to be or anyone I knew. I was just, I didn't want it to happen again. I was, I remember I was terrified for a long time. Mm -hmm. Did your parents let you see much of the TV? Yes, we watched the news a lot. Did you get to see the towers fall? Yes. What did you think when you saw that and all those lives lost in those few seconds? It was just, it was awful to, to see all that. It was just really sad. Yeah. Okay. Let's ask Cassidy a couple of questions. So tell me, so what were you like at almost 10 years ago? What were some of your interests? Were you also in second grade? I, I was in first grade. You were in first yes. grade. Tell me what you were. Just outside of 9-11, what were you, what were you doing back then? Um, I was playing a lot of soccer. Um, <laughs> uh, hanging out with my friends, being with my family. Um, just your typical kid? Yes, just, yeah, just normal things. 